Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Mass Effect 2 here on the Game Professor channel. I'm your host, the Game Professor, and today we are going to start off by talking to Legion to see if we can get his or its, I don't know right pronoun for Legion, um, there. Technically they are a collective, so yeah, we'll, we'll go with there, um, with their loyalty. Shepard Commander, we have completed our analysis of the Reaper's data core. What did you learn? Did you find anything useful? We were sent to the old machine to preserve the Geth's future. We are prepared to reveal how. The heretics have developed a weapon to use against Geth. You would call it a virus. It is stored on a data core provided by Sovereign. Hmm. Over time, the virus will change us, make us conclude that worshipping the old machines is correct. Okay... Tell me about the infection speed. If it were released, how quickly would this virus spread through your people? We are networked via FTL com buoys. Most would change within a day. Isolated platforms would remain unaffected until they rejoin the network. Okay. I thought Geth couldn't be hacked or get viruses, at least for more than a few seconds. Altered programs are restored from archives. New installations are deleted. This heretic weapon hmm. introduces a subtle operating error in our most basic runtimes, the equivalent of your nervous system. An equation with a result of 1.33382 returns as 1.33381. This changes the results of all higher processes. We will reach different conclusions. Very interesting. So essentially it's the equivalent of genetic mutation, effectively. So the virus would give all Geth the heretics logic, and all Geth would then go to war with organics. Yes, Geth believe all intelligent life should self-determinate. The heretics no longer share this belief. Hmm. They judge that forcing an invalid conclusion on us is preferable to a continued schism. Interesting, alright. So why did you need to go to the Reaper corpse? The heretics store the code in a quantum storage device Sovereign provided. To find and destroy the virus, we needed to understand its code and data storage structures. All right. Yeah, can you find the virus? You know where this thing is? The Heretics Headquarters Station on the edge of the Terminus. We will provide coordinates. Normandy stealth systems are necessary to safely approach. All right. Um, tell me about the possibility of opposition. What defenses should we expect? In space, none. Within, mobile platforms of various configuration and non-sentient defense turrets. Okay. How many Geth? There may be billions of individual programs. Fortunately, most will be uploaded to the central computer. Only hmm. a few mobile platforms are maintained at any time. Others are manufactured when needed. Interesting. All right. What's the plan once we get aboard? The Geth will disrupt their network, prevent the station's defenses from focusing on us. The Reaper data core is physically isolated from the network. We will need to be escorted to it to access and destroy the data. Alrighty. And yeah, Terminus systems. They build stations in the Terminus? Where is this thing? Between stars. Organics have no cause to look there. Yeah, why not in Geth space? But why do they build stations outside Geth territory in the first place? The heretics seek improvement from the old machines. In exchange, they help them attack organics. We condemn these judgments. All right. Now we'll stop them. I won't let them brainwash your race. Especially not to worship Reapers. You have my word on that. We will begin preparations. All right. Did we get some Paragon? No. Oh, man. We need to get as much Paragon as possible so that we can get Miranda's loyalty back. Um. Hmm. Alright. Let's go and take care of Legion's loyalty, though. Because this is actually a pretty fun loyalty mission. We'll also have a little, little bit of a callback, in a way to what we saw in um, Prometheus Station in the Overlord DLC. 
because we will be back on a geth structure no for you, Commander. you told me i had one last time so i know yes so dr archer's brother Ooh, uh, i had a feeling the elusive man was going to say something Shepard, I understand you've taken Dr. Archer's brother to Grissom Academy. I'm familiar with their work. It should be a good home for him. I don't condone Dr. Archer's actions, but they did provide a breakthrough we've been solely lacking thus far. We'll likely never find another individual with David's unique talents. Though your decision is understandable, it has set our efforts to understand the Geth back several years. Yeah, I don't care. And, um... Uh, yeah, I am aware that you are, that this is me, player, I'm aware that you are familiar with Grissom Academy's work because that is the subject of one of the extra textu textual novels um, within the Mass Effect series, um, Mass Effect Ascension. So, yeah, I'm, I'm very aware of that. Let's go on, though. Um, Sea of Storms to help Legion. Perfect. I didn't even realize that this was in this area, so this actually, timing-wise, works out perfectly. Heretic Station. We will just get right to it. Once called Haratar by the Koreans, the space station was stripped of its useful technology by the fleeing migrant feet when they left the Perseus Vale 300 years ago. Very interesting. So. This will be a very tech heavy uh, mission. So I'm probably, I'll probably bring Garrus with Legion. Because I don't really need the biotics, but having additional combat power will help. I have lots of, lots of stuff for, should I actually verify. That I know which one gives me my Paragon boost? Because I know one of these gives me a Paragon boost. And now I don't know which one. No. I'll have to look at it a bit. So Legion. We will boost your Infiltrator. I like that. Geth Assassin. Legion has become an expert at disassembling organics and synthetics alike, increasing Legion's weapon damage. 15% health, 25% damage, and 25% reduction in recharge time. Or more health for Trooper. Legion has created redundant systems for its critical functions, increasing its health. So, I am going... It's a total of 30... Versus 38 or 40 versus 38. I'm gonna go with the weapon damage. And I'll give you a high hacking. And then I'm gonna give you a good drone. Attack drone. You have upgraded the combat drone so it's electric shock damages target health, armor, and biotic barriers. 40 points of damage, 160% health bonus, 3 seconds, duration 18. Uh, let's do the explosive one. I like that. That all looks good to me. And eventually I... Yep, you get that. And then I'm going to give you... The Vindicator as well because I like the Vindicator it is a darn good assault rifle and you don't need to use a Geth pulse rifle just because you're a Geth you know it's just our heat emissions that are hidden right they could look out a window and see us coming windows are structural weaknesses Geth do not use them approach the hull of these coordinates Access achieved. We may proceed. Joker. 
I love that disapproving look. It's brilliant. So simple and so brilliant. Alert. This facility has little arrow gravity. Geth require neither. Mm-hmm. Alarms? Won't we be detected? Don't they have intrusion alarms? Sensors have been reduced. We have infiltrated their wireless network and filled the data storage with random bits. Okay. And that helps us how? The heretics must scrub this junk data. They have partitioned themselves into local networks working in parallel. Any alarm we trigger will not go beyond the room we are in. Only accessing the main core will trigger a station-wide alert. All right. We've got a job to do. Let's get to it. Shepard Commander, we concluded that destruction of the station was the only resolution to the heretic question. There is now a second option. Hmm. Their virus can be repurposed. If released into the station's network, the heretics will be rewritten to accept our truth. That sounds dangerously close to indoctrination, unless there's something I'm missing. And maybe this is how AIs settle religious disputes. The Geth are already a threat to organics, though. If we give them back their heretics, they'll get even stronger. Um... Why didn't you tell us this earlier? Why didn't you mention this before we came aboard? We did not know the virus was complete. It is. Hmm. It can be used against the true Geth at any time. Our arrival was timely. Well, all right. They're your people, Legion. You must have an opinion. This is new data. We have not yet reached consensus. Okay. We will process as the mission proceeds. Okay. Well, I would say that rewriting is unethical. I wouldn't brainwash an organic race. I can't see treating the Geth differently. The question is irrelevant. If we do not rewrite them, we destroy them. That is why we are here. Do not hesitate now. Mm -hmm. They will exterminate your species because they're gods. Tell them to. You cannot negotiate with them. They do not share your pity, Rumo. All right. Going that way. All right. A med kit. Thank you. I'm pretty low. Oh, I'm actually not that low on many gel right now. That's a surprise. Okay. The Geth are inactive. Maybe we can sneak past them. Interrupting data streams will alert local network. We recommend preemptive strikes against heartland routers. So basically, we just don't want to touch these lines. But what thing we can do, because we are about to see several. Oh, dang it. I got too far over. All right. Well. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, boy. That was a thing. Oh, boy. Well. There we go. Now I just have to... Really, Legion? You got all the way over there? Well. There we go. have to destroy the hub. Why are all the heretics attached to these hubs? These are mobile platforms. Hardware. The hmm. crew is software. They are communing through the station's central computer. Okay. I'm not sure I follow. The heretics connect to the main computer to exchange data memories and program updates. We gain complexity by linking together. To be isolated within a single platform is to be reduced. We see less, comprehend less. It is quieter. If you exchange data hmm. memories, how do you keep track of which ones are yours? How do you stay you? There is only we. We were created to share data among ourselves. The difference between death is perspective. We are many eyes looking at the same things. One platform will see things another does not, and will make different judgments. Okay. Yeah, the heretics are part of you. I can see why you'd be conflicted about the heretics. In a way, whatever you do to them, you're doing to yourself. Mm -hmm. Yes. Once they return to us and upload their memories, we will share their experience of being altered. 
That could definitely be traumatizing. Every other species I know of might be psychologically scarred by a traumatic experience like that. It is not clear if Geth can be traumatized. We do not feel pain as you do. We cannot predict what the effects will be. Let's keep moving. Yes. It really is an interesting conundrum with Legion. There's, there's a lot to consider with this mission. Um, obviously, I am... We can assume control of any defensive turret. They will assist us briefly, then self-destruct. Okay. Get the hunter down. One less to worry about. There we go. Beautiful. Oh. Garrus did die on me. I didn't realize he had. Couldn't tell. Well, let's get the ammo. Um, and continue on. All right, now we're starting to get into a slightly more difficult bit here. Can I destroy the hub like that? Because we're going to have two sets of folksies. I don't remember if this is glass or not. We've been spotted. There we go. All right, oh, I'm going to get here. Processed. Oh. There we go. Of course. Well, let's get Garrus back up. Oh, there's the other hunter. Dang it. Um. There we go. All right, the hunter's back under its own control. We get Garrus back up again. Target contact. Come on. Where is? There we go. Goodness gracious, Garrus. Oh my goodness. Um. Ah! Crap. Dang it. <laughs> All right. Garrus just goes goes too head first into everything. He he really just dives right into it. It's, it's silly of him. It's silly. It's okay though. We still love him. Even if he's just our broski, we still love him. So, it's going to have me go through this again, so I'll bring you back when we're back in that room. Alright. There we go. Bye bye, Hunter. Now, drone, don't explode on us. There we go. All right. And we're already back in the room. So, very quick, as as you can tell, uh, I am still gonna destroy the Geth hub here first. Because my goal here, generally speaking, is Careful. there we go. Let's hack. Okay. 
Come on. There we go. All right. Medi gel to get Legion back up. All right. There's our other hunter. Fire in the hole. Come on. There we go. Now, will you come back? No, you're not going to. Of course not. That's too practical. We got both of the hunters down, though. That's the important thing. There we go. Whoa, hello. There we go. That's what I wanted. There we go. Alrighty. There we go. Now we're making progress. There we go. That everybody? Yes, it is. Wonderful. Get our other Guth hub. And then this one over here. Get all the ammo we can. Whoops. There we go. Excellent. Then it's just about continuing on. Verify I'm not missing any ammo. I think I got it all. Well, actually, you know what? There was an extra bit of ammo back this way that I can get, I think. Which, I'm the sort of person, I'll do that. They closed the door on me. Rude game. Very rude. All right. I don't remember how many rooms we have to go through for this. Oh, hello! That was unexpected. I feel... yeah, that's what I thought. Dang. This is actually a very difficult fight just because of the visuals. My goodness. I am not a fan of how foggy this station is. The only things I really remember about this mission is several rooms that we have to go through and then a final stand basically I did not remember any of these uh, little hallway fights there we go beautiful ammo ammo Bueller Bueller well, fine. Don't give me ammo, game. Okay. Oh. Oh, hello. There is a hunter over there. Where's that hunter? There's the hunter. The hunter is what I care about. Because hunters are the problem, Geth. In this game. It really is mostly just the primes that are problematic in the first game. In this game, it is the hunters. Hunters are incredibly difficult because of that cloaking ability of theirs. Man, it's not going to give me any ammo. It's really not going to give me any ammo. Wow. Dang. Okay. Well, I got something. 
There is nothing else. My goodness. I am definitely spoiled by <laughs> the fixed ammo drops. There we go. Got heavy ammo and regular ammo. So, let's see here. Okay, that's the direction we need to go. It's probably not going to let me go back to get that ammo once I'm through this room. But that's fine. Get yep, terminal. Let's bypass this terminal. Oh, God! Alright, well. Because I'm under attack, I can't do it. Okay. Dang it! Okay, well. <laughs> that was unexpected. I didn't even think about that. Though that makes perfect sense. Um, I should have thought about that. Well, we won't do that this time. Hopefully it'll just put me right back where I was. I'm pretty sure that's where I last saw a save occur. Yep. So, not too far of a backtrack. That's fine. Yep. There we go. Only a little bit of a backtrack. Nothing too crazy. And let's get the palladium. Since it probably won't let, as I said, it probably won't let us go back here. Ugh. Let's see here. And yeah, we're just going to go straight into this. Um. Uh, hack, hack the hunter for us, please. Shield to fail. Enemy dead. There we go. Automated flight weapon ring. There we go. There we go. All right. Wow. That's something. Now I can bypass this terminal. There we go. And then... Yeah, the shield strength, always good. Oh, it actually will let me go back through here. Well then, I'm going to go get that ammo. <laughs> if it's going to let me go through there, I'm getting the ammo, dang it. There we go. And there probably will be some ammo drops in here at this point. I would hope so. You're kidding me. Really? Nothing? There's nothing? Rude. Alright. I think we'll have one more room with um, hubs. Because there's a particular hub room that I, that I know we haven't reached yet. Yep. Here it is. And I often have two different approaches to this. Sometimes I'll just kind of make everything go and just then have siphon the hunters up so that I can get them to 
taken care of on their own so that I don't get surrounded. And you know what? I think I'm going to do that. We're going to do this. We have been detected. Yes, we have. So basically, I'm just waiting for them to start coming up. Because they will work their way up. At least they should. Where? All right, yeah, they're starting to move now. There we go. There's a hunter. Targeting order processed. All right, get Garrus back up. Let's uh, get that one. Need help. Shoot. Goodness gracious. Under fire. There we go. Taking hits. Oh, there are three. Yeah, this is this is what I always forget is that there are three, but as long as I'm keeping them far enough away from me that the shotgun doesn't do that much damage, it's fine. That's the key, is just preventing the shotgun from killing me super fast. Taking hits. There's our other hunter. There we go. Alright. Well, and I'm almost out of ammo now, so we are going to switch to you. Um... There we go. Got Garrus back up. And that is everybody. Yeah. The hunters are such a pain. You just don't want to be dealing with a bunch of them possibly surrounding you. If you can avoid having them surround you, that is critical. And this room is so hard to not have them surround you. That's why I'm just like, keep them away from me. I don't want to be anywhere near them. To quickly verify on ammo, doesn't look like it. And... Huh. This isn't like the other hubs we've seen here. This is a database. It contains a portion of the heretic's accumulated memories. Hmm. Wait. We discovered copies of our current patrol routes in this database. Hmm. This suggests the heretics have left times within our networks. Is that surprising? We wouldn't be here if the heretics wanted to be friends with the Geth. Why wouldn't they spy on you? Uh-huh. You do not understand. Organics do not know each other's minds. Geth do. We are not suspicious. We accept each other. The heretics desired to leave. We understood their reasons. We allowed it. There was peace between us. Yeah, the... Something is definitely up. It couldn't have lasted forever. You disagreed about what path your race should take. Human history is a litany of blood shed over different ideals of rulership and afterlife. Death have no such history. We shared consensus on such things. How could we have become so different? Why can we no longer understand each other? What did we do wrong? Yeah, it's not your fault. When individuals are separated, they develop in different ways. When they get back together, they don't always get along. Mm -hmm. If this is the individuality you value, we question your judgment. This topic is irrelevant. We must return to the mission. Have you reached consensus? Have you reached a decision about whether to rewrite the heretics or not? We are still trying to build consensus. Some processes judge destruction preferable. Others rewrite. Your opinion? Have you reached a decision oh. about whether we to rewrite the heretics? Okay, fine. Consensus. 
Some processes judge destruction preferable, others rewrite. Let's keep moving. Yes. All right, and I am going to finish up the episode here, everybody, just because I know the next fight is probably going... The next bits, bits of fighting are probably going to be 10, 15 minutes. So don't want to make the episode run on that long. So thank you so much for watching, everybody. Be sure to hit the subscribe button so you always know when I have new videos coming out and follow the links in the description to the Facebook page and Discord server so you can join the conversation. But until next time, everybody, this is your Game Professor signing off. I'll see you then.